Hello good people, beyond all the scientists had to say about the fact that the world goes round, the evolution of fashion trend is another evidence to consider. More as our dress sense is going all the way up with new entries taking the upper hand in the Nigerian fashion space, it's amazing to see some blasts from the past looking too cool to be true these days. One definitely that isn't letting fashion lovers down is the denim on denim look that started in the cowboy ages. But today I bet you didn't see this particular one I want to share with you coming. Mm. Do most of you recognize this fashion statement? Hell yeah, taking you back to the bib and brace overalls which were originally designed in the 1700s as a protective clothing for farmers, manual laborers and slaves. According to the history of this fashion trend, it is believed to have come from an Indian word, Dungri, which resulted to the name Dungarees. Like you know, Nigerians rename almost any and every trend making the rounds, so we asked a couple of people if they remember this trend and what they call it. Yeah, I do recognize it. Yeah, sure, I wear it back then. I've worn it before. Back then, it's called overall. I know it as jungle Spinafo. Back then, overall or something. Back then, we used to call it somebody lawyer. Oh my, somebody lawyer. Very interesting. I don't really know what it's called. I, I forgot to, I can't remember. Also wondered if they ever wore this overall and how they rocked it best. I rocked this role. Uh, yeah, I rocked it back then. No, I didn't wear it. I put it on with different kind of tops. Me, I like simple something. I rocked it with white, white and black then. I wear canvas. I wear my pin out for it. Armless, long shirt. I can I rock it on the normal flat slippers? Soft work. Coming in short alls and overalls, we were also curious as to who rocked it better, the ladies or the guys. It looks better on male. It looks better on female. No, on male. It's more fashionable on women. I don't really like it on male. It looks better on female. On male, it looks swag. I like it on female. Because it's to show all your curves. It makes sense. If you're a guy and you have the kind of boy that just anything you put some feet to, fine. You can put one arm down legally or look corporate. Anything you want it to look like. To men wearing it, I don't know. It's a crap, I don't like it. To so just look odd. We less famished. Ladies love make men, and we head established. A lot of people seem to think that this fashion trend is definitely an ultimate comfort when it comes to style. It's a comfortable style. It's a comfortable style. Yeah, it's comfortable. It's a comfortable style. Yeah, it's a comfortable style. Yeah, it's comfortable. Is it wear? This is not too tight on the body. It's a comfortable style. You know, go manage. Package, package. With the old school trends coming back in fashion now, we push forward to ask if they see themselves rocking this style given that it comes back. Yeah, I can buy it so that me too, I will feel among them. Yeah, I would love to rock it. I can be the first person to bring it. Like I will still rock them. It's too, it's rock now. Because they are really cool. I rock it. Like I have, I have like three. I have short, I have a three cutter one, I have the long one. Fact, I'm planning on getting one. I'll pull my swag with this. If I have an event, like a party, I'll get it. Most time I want to go to the beach, I can just wear the short one. I wear a very small top on that. I'm good to go. DJ Spiro! You know the money. I'm sure you're wondering whether or not you will. Well, nothing is impossible. Never say never, especially to cool fashion trend comebacks. For more information, visit www.viewchannel.com, like our page on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, and follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Views Channel.